the title game of the girls state B tournament. The Cole Strip Phillies taking on the Jefferson Panthers for a shot at basketball immortality. Cole Strip making its third trip to the title game in eight years. Meanwhile, the Panthers newcomers as they step onto the championship stage for the first time in program history. Let's get to it. Some early jitters as neither team has a field goal for the first half of the first quarter. But Jefferson's Kia Stuber about to get the show rolling. She hits the charity stripe jumper and the Panthers grab a two-point lead. Now Brenna Wolf, nice inside feed to Dakota Edmiston and she drops in the layup to put Jefferson up by four. But the Phillies only loss this season is to the Panthers and they haven't forgotten that. Off the steal, Malia Egan is gonna drive right to the rim and she drops in the floater to tie things up. And now Kansas, his bad horse, spins her way to the rim and it falls through to put the Phillies in the lead. Next possession, his bad horse again making her presence felt under the basket. Cole Strip leads by four. Well, you knew you'd hear this name eventually. Rachel Van Blericom willing her way into the post and she lays it in to make it a two point game. But end of the third quarter and Kansas, his bad horse have a game. That makes it a double digit lead and the Phillies win state 56 to 43 for their first state title since 1999. I caught up with Kansas after the game. I don't know, it's kind of unrealistic. Like, I don't know how to feel because we've been working so hard for it and it just came true.